Sunset glows over a golden field. Thin light shines on the edge of a fishtail. A mythical creature, Kirin, roars as if it's jumping out of the painting. The artwork, all brought to life with lacquerware artisan Wang Qingshuang's gentle touch. Wang is the first lacquer artisan to win Taiwan's National Cultural Award. He went to Japan to study the craft when he was just 19 years old. After 85 years honing his skills, the 100-year-old is passing down his legacy to his grandson. Writer Li Minyong was also honored for preserving Taiwan's social movements in his literature. His work spanned novels, prose, and translations. Motivated by the decades-long Vietnam War, Li began writing anti-war poems in the 1960s. He then went on to create more provocative work that challenged Taiwan's autocratic regime in the 70s and 80s. Conductor Lu Xiaoqia has also been recognized for his contribution to Taiwan. Lu gained international fame after winning competitions in France, Italy, and the Netherlands when he was in his 20s. After spending years in Europe working with prestigious orchestras, he returned home in 2010. The National Cultural Award was first established in 1981. Since then, including this year's recipients, only 90 people have received the honor. Kama Xu, Yu Jing Huang, and Hame Okan for Taiwan Plus.